The simple circuit can be used to drive flashing LEDs, complex digital circuits, or a homemade synthesizer. This video will demonstrate the process of building an A-stable oscillator, or square wave generator. For this video, you will need a breadboard, jumper wires, a 9-volt battery, battery clips, a 9 to 5 volt voltage regulator, an LED, resistors, a 7555 timer IC, a speaker, an audio amplifier, a 100 microfarad and 10 microfarad capacitor, a potentiometer, an eighth inch audio jack, audio cables, and alligator clips. This is a schematic representation of an A-stable oscillator. We will use the 7555 IC or integrated circuit to build the oscillator. Here is the pinout of the 7555. This diagram shows the conventional pin numbering system for ICs. The notch marks the head of the IC, and pin 1 is to the left of this notch. In addition, or sometimes in place of a notch, pin 1 may be marked by a small dot. Our circuit is centered around the 7555. Place the IC over the trough of the breadboard with pin 1 facing left. Pause the video and place the necessary components as they are shown. Now we can connect the 7555 to the voltage and ground rail. We also connect pin 2 to pin 6, as shown here. If you're using multiple wires to bridge pins 2 and 6, be sure that the rows you go through are unused by other components. Here's a sneak peek at what our circuit will do once a capacitor is added. Connect the 10 microfarad capacitor between pins 1 and 2. Capacitors are often polar, so be sure to connect the negative lead, marked with a vertical stripe of the capacitor, to pin 2. We run pin 3, the output of the 7555, through a 100 microfarad capacitor, which acts as a high-pass filter to remove any DC from the output signal. Pin 5 is connected to variable voltage from a potentiometer, which allows you to control the oscillator's frequency. Our A-stable oscillator is complete. Let's connect our circuit to a speaker to hear it work. Here, we have a TRS, or three conductor, quarter inch jack. Connect the black lead to ground and the red lead to the negative lead of the 100 microfarad capacitor. You can now use a simple amplifier and speaker setup to boost the output of the 7555 to an audible level.